Hey beautiful souls, David Essery here. I've been very blessed recently to have been joined by Melchizedek a lot. Of course, I've been working with him in preparation for tonight's final part of the Soul Reclamation Pathway. So he's been around a lot, but I've also received a couple of messages for him. One, of course, I shared yesterday the, about the energy for the month of May. Today, I wanted to share another one with you that I'm really, really excited about. This is what he had to say. The great recall is about to begin. A time when those few truly committed souls who have worked so hard since the beginning to increase their light shall reap the rewards of their efforts. For this to take place, these adepts must be prepared physically, mentally, emotionally and spiritually. Of course they have trained for this for some time, but what is to come is of a new order, a frequency that has not yet been held for more than a brief period. And yet this is to become the normal. This is why there has been such a drive for the initiates to release, to create space for more light, to ensure that, that which is opposed to this new wave does not cause disharmony when the two energies meet. This preparation is well underway, but greater achievement can always be made when dictated by the conscious mind. This is why we offer an opportunity to actively prepare. Within the great plains of Amenti, a new body awaits you, one constructed of pure crystalline light and specifically designed for those who wish to harmonize with this jump shift at the highest level. This crystalline structure has been crafted just for you and is ready for your seat. Join us, my beloved, in the great temple to receive this gift and be blessed with a light body upgrade never before seen on the mother planet. Yours in divine reverence, Melchizedek. Thank you, Melchizedek, for that beautiful message. He was very excited when this was coming through. It really felt charged up. He starts it by saying, the great recall is about to begin. Based on what he said in my May message and stuff like that, I believe again he's still talking about the solstice here, the midway solstice as he called it there. He says, a time when those few truly committed souls who have worked so hard since the beginning to increase their light shall reap the rewards of their efforts. We of course have been working since the beginning of this ascension process, some of us for even longer to clear, to drop density, to overcome the challenges of our past, to allow more light in, to help prepare us for these roles. We have worked incredibly hard for this. And he says that we are gonna reap the rewards for all that we've done. He says that we need to be prepared for this, physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually, which of course we've been doing for some time, as he says. But this is where it gets interesting. He says, for what is to come is of a new order, a frequency that has not yet been held for more than a brief period. He's talking about the sixth dimension. So for us, you know, the moment that the ascension process started in 2012, we jumped from 3D to 4D. Well, it's the planet jumped from to 4D and we were kind of brought along with it. When we're doing our work, when we're raising our vibration right up, we're bringing ourselves to the fifth dimension. When we are really actively working, doing workshops and stuff like that, we do go well beyond this. You know, it's not uncommon to pull in seventh, ninth, even higher dimensional light. But until now, we've only been able to hold that frequency for a short period of time. You know, I've seen in a number of uh, my workshops, chakras changing to like crystalline, opaque um, colors, like they go like more, more passively color. This is when the chakras are going into the sixth, the sixth dimension, but they don't last that long. You know, they, that's a, a short kind of stayed thing. Other upgrades happen, of course, from the benefits from that, but they have been reverting back to their normal colors. He is saying here that what is to come is of a new order, a frequency that's not yet been held for more than a brief period. He's talking about us holding a six dimensional period, uh, six dimensional energy, sorry, from now on. That is a big, big shift. 
Of course, he's talking about this for the initiates, those of us that are doing the work. This isn't like a, every single person is going to be holding this frequency, but we are going to have the option to, you know, the ability to do this with these new upgrades that are coming. And he explains that this is why we've been releasing so much. Of course, we had this crazy month of April where we've all been letting go, but it's a process that started you know, before the winter solstice. There was a really big push to release back then, and we have been ever since then, really. As um, Melchizedek said in that in my message for May that we were given a six month dispensation from the last solstice to this one to realign in the new energies because the planet went through a massive jump shift there. That's what we've been doing, dropping as much density as we can to prepare for this moment. He says that this preparation is well underway, but greater achievement can always be made when directed by the conscious mind. You know, we are always doing this naturally on a higher level, on a subconscious level with the planetary alignments, the solar flares, the eclipses we've been having. We are constantly evolving and we are preparing this. But of course, if we are actively trying to do it, we are setting our intent and our focus, we can achieve so much more, so much quicker. Again, where it gets really interesting. Within the great plains of Amenti, a new body awaits you. One constructed of pure crystalline light and specifically designed for those who wish to harmonize with this jump shift at the highest level. This crystalline structure has been crafted just for you and is ready for your receipt. So the plains of Amenti is a much higher frequency version of the Halls of Amenti. This is something that um, came to Tim Wilde and I as we were working on the Soul Reclamation Pathway when we were taken to this other planet that in many ways looks similar to the Halls of Amenti, but actually the Halls are kind of like a gateway. When you go into the Halls, what you are accessing is a version of the information from the planes. But if you go to the planes, it's a much higher vibration and access to everything is there. They, a new body awaits you, he says, one constructed of pure crystalline light. We've been talking about, you know, the crystalline light bodies for years, and that's the natural evolution for humans. And it's specifically designed for those who wish to harmonize with this jump shift at the highest level. So basically, this crystalline light body will assist us to hold the sixth dimensional frequency in a much easier way to really anchor that light in. And that one basically has been crafted for you and is ready for your receipt if you wish to claim it. Then, to my surprise, join us, my beloved, being me and Melchizedek, in the great temple to receive this gift and be blessed with a light body upgrade never before seen on another planet. So I am running a workshop with Melchizedek. Um, I didn't know this before, <laughs> before this, but I will gratefully accept any opportunity to work with Melchizedek in this way. To basically, in this workshop, we are going to be going into the planes of Amenti. We are going to be having a full energetic system, clear out, let go of absolutely everything else remaining that we can do before we step into this crystalline body where we accept this body and we integrate it with us to prepare us for this great shift coming. I'm honored to be able to do this with Melchizedek and very, very excited about the opportunity. So yeah, that's my next workshop, which of course is uh, coming up later this month on May the 18th, 7 p.m. in the UK. You can check the time in different countries uh, on my website as well. It's going to be an amazing experience. I have no doubt of that. An honor to get to work with Melchizedek again. And what an incredible upgrade opportunity we have. It's going to be an hour and a half session because we've got a lot to do within this. I want to make sure that we've got the time to do it properly. If you feel like joining me and Melchizedek, I would absolutely love to have you there. I'll pop the link down in the description below. And yeah, really looking forward to seeing some of you there. It's going to be amazing. Sending you all so much love. Bye-bye. Just when you think you're done, Melchizedek popped into my ear. He said, I'm not to go until I tell you that he loves you all with all of his heart. And he's so honored to be able to step forward with this opportunity to share with you. And he is looking forward to it. Is that it, Father? 
yeah, I think that's it. <laughs> Sending you all so much love and see you again soon. Bye-bye.